Adelaide Oval has been given a thumbs up from the Redbacks ahead of their first match there tomorrow. Eddie Godfrey joins us now live from the ground. Eddie, how's it looking? Well, Kate, Redbacks coach Darren Berry concedes the playing surface here isn't quite perfect, but he's given it an 8 out of 10 and he's very much looking forward to the first Sheffield Shield match. He's hoping as many as 5,000 fans come through tomorrow with seating available over in the Western Stand and here on the Northern Mound. But today was all about putting those finishing touches on a new look oval. Nearly two years in the making and still far from finished, Adelaide Oval is ready for its first test. It's history making, it looks fantastic. South Australian bosses tomorrow let their people off work in the afternoon to come down to Adelaide Oval. The pitch has been rolled, the crease lines drawn and that slightly sandy and uneven outfield good enough to go. I don't think it's 10 out of 10 and I think the groundsman would say that. I reckon he's got it to about an 8 out of 10 at the moment and certainly more than adequate for a Shield game. The Redbacks coach has warned his players to be careful when diving during their four-dayer against the Warriors, but he is confident the ground will be pitch perfect to host the Ashes in three weeks' time. I'm sure when the test match starts, it'll be 11 out of 10. Saka's boss just as sure the half-billion dollar redevelopment is on schedule. And that includes the, the outfield, the pitch, the southern stand, um, the replay screens, the new turnstiles. Um, yeah, we're on track for delivery. Admission will be free when the gates swing open at 10 tomorrow morning. Some construction will continue around the ground in an effort to trial the new Southern Stand next week. Eddie Godfrey, Nine News.